Okay, Christy, this is my um, original SS180 uh, wiring loom. I did go ahead and buy a new one, but in all honesty, I wish I had just made my own. Uh, it's not too hard to make. Anyways, um, I have the Rally 180 round headset and the tractor, not the Mickey Mouse kind, but the tractor style, um, excuse my dog down there, tractor style um, tail light. Let's go ahead, on the left side is the front of your bike, and the right side is the tail. There's my original HT coil and uh, spark plug. And let me go ahead and give you the colors that I have. Okay, so for what I believe is the horn right here, I have got a uh, two browns, two browns, a uh, black that's doubled up. One of the browns also has a gray wire coming out of it. Um, I don't know what that gray one was. So the black is filmed right here. Then a brown, another brown, and a gray coming out of it. Uh, for the uh, switch, here's the colors I have. Let's move, open this up so we can look at them all good. White, green, the darker green by the way, pink, yellow, black, blue, red, purple. Again, white, dark green, yellow, kind of a pink, light green, black, blue, brown, and purple. Coming all the way down. I then have what I believe is the horn. And for the horn, I have um, green and white. And I apologize, back up to the front here. I think I might have accidentally said horn, but this would be the headset. The gray is for, um, so yeah, that makes total sense. This is, the gray goes to the um, high beam light. So that's correct. And uh, that's why it's uh, cut off there as is. Okay, so we've got the horn. We've got the, okay, the headlight, horn. No, damn it, headlight, switch, horn. Let's go all the way down to where we break off at the first bit. So you see the Y there, and then in the middle, right here, out comes a couple different colors. And this is gonna be the tail light. For my tail light, I had black, yellow, blue. All right, now for the brake light, you can see the originals uh, are still welded in place here. Uh, brake light is blue and black. Now let's go over to the uh, coil. A single green, a double blue, a pink, and a black. Let's go over the whole thing one more time. Okay, starting at the top for the wire loom. Headlight. Two browns. There's a dark brown a light brown. The light brown has a gray coming out for the high beam. Two blacks connected to one connector. Okay. Switch on the handlebars. White, dark green, yellow, pink, light green, black, blue, brown, purple. Coming down to the horn. Green, white. Going over to the tail light, black, yellow, blue. Coming up to the HT coil, green, a double blue connected, a pink, and a black. And finally, over to the brake, black, blue. So there you have the entire thing. And for those of you that are considering making your own, I, you know what, this would have been really easy and I probably should have even done it for my 12 volt ignition on the uh, Lamy that I'm doing. And I didn't. At Harbor Freight or any Harbor Freight tools or auto stores, you can buy a bunch of the stuff. So I've got, I've got the tubing. It's hidden, so I mean, really, are you gonna see 
that it says uh, stuff on it. Nah, I'm not really going to see it. That's your call, though. Uh, wires are inexpensive. You can get all the colors you possibly want. You can buy connectors at... Uh, uh, you can buy connectors Home Depot or uh, Radio Shack. Anyways, I hope this is helpful, and I'll take a uh, photographs of close-ups of everything, but hopefully this will prove very helpful for you and anyone else. I encourage you guys all, just make your own. It's going to cost you like 20 bucks, if even, maybe. And I had to change some of the connectors on mine, one that I bought anyway, so you might as well just get it and make it to fit at your bike. Um, just copy your original. I would suspect that this could take, uh, hmm, I bet I could make it in less than 20 minutes. Hope this helps, Chrissy. I'll post some um, close-up pictures as well.